Is it on? Okay, watch this, guys. I'm gonna bag me a big old moose. <laughs> Mom? Mom? Oh, shoot! I'm sorry! Fifty-seven, fifty-eight, fifty-nine, sixty. You see that? I'm the only girl in school who can do more than ten pull-ups. So whatever you can throw at me, I can handle it. Bring it! Hey! You're dead! Do you hear me? So, if you want a really strong competitor who gets along with everyone, pick me! You can edit this, right? Awesome, thanks. Hey, I'm Noah. You may not know me, but you will, because I'm going places. See, I've got a plan. Hey, Noah, way to go on winning class president. You deserve it, man. Thanks, Joey. See, I got smarts, and that's what wins in the end. Trust me, I got this one in the bag. Justin. 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 on this show is a real athlete, and I'm your man. Yeah, baby, catch this action. Okay, so there are some things you should know about me. Um, I'm really loyal, and I'm like so smart you have no idea, maybe even a genius. And but the thing I'm best at is I'm awesome at twirling fire batons. Okay, ready? Okay. Hey. Oh. Oops. Oops. <laughs> okay. Should not do that indoors. <laughs> Sorry, mom. Girl, you know it's true. You make me feel so blue when you don't come around. I was lost and now I'm found. Come on, Cody. What did I tell you about making all that noise? Sorry, Dad. He just doesn't get it. I'm gonna be a superstar one day. Even bigger. One day, I'm gonna be a star. You'll see. They'll all see. running for student council president. And if I win, I'll be the youngest one ever at this school. If you pick me for your new show, I promise I'll conduct myself with integrity, honor, and I'll get two new pop machines for the cafeteria. Oh, I just mixed up the two speeches. Can we start over? What do you mean, no? I mean, I've got to get to gym class. You promised you'd take my audition for Total Drama Island, Tom. Look, just give me the camera. Give it to me! Ugh. You are so not going to be my secretary if I win. <laughs> Vote for Courtney! <laughs> I've got badges in bass fishing, basketry, farm mechanics, model making, rabbit raising, and stamp collecting with a master badge in compass reading. <laughs>
I'm just a man, just a one woman man. Yeah, that's all I am. And if I can, I want to find that one woman. Oh, crap. Okay, Bridge, we're rolling. <laughs> All right. Go for it, Bridge. All right. Show what you got, babe. Okay, <laughs> here goes. <laughs> okay, I know I suck, but I am a real friend and an honest player, and if you pick me, I promise to either win with integrity or leave with my head held high. The audition sheet says to list my best qualities, but <laughs> there's so many. I'm pretty and smart, and I get along with everyone, even ugly girls. Mm -hmm. I love camping, even though I've never gone. I have bikinis for every season, even the ones not listed on the calendar, and I'm bilingual. I speak fluent English and American. Hey, dog, DJ here. I think I'd be a good contestant for Total Drama Island because I'm kind and courteous, I work well with others, and I'm strong, and, well, I was raised right. Thanks, Mom. Actually, my mom's the reason I want to win. She taught me that I could be anything I want. <laughs> I love you, Mom. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Thanks for listening. <laughs> Bye. Is name my freaky being enjoy I. <laughs> Woo! Okay, okay. Here's what I can do. Okay, I can um, roll my eyes all the way back in my head. Okay. I can also double join both of my elbows. Okay, catch an eyeful of this. <laughs> okay. And I can, oh, I can wrap my tongue uh, around my head like a turban. Just like, yeah, I can wrap. Okay, so let me be on Total Drama Island. Boring be never will it. <laughs> Here she. What, Mom? Just a typical weeknight with me and my bugs. Just a couple hundred of us. A van, 60 or 70 party pizzas. <laughs> Woo! See, life is over like that, man. You don't stop and have a party every Monday or uh, every Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. You're gonna regret it. So, peace, chill out, party. It's all good, my friends. I'm giving a shout out to my TDI crew. If you want a sister who's straight up large and in charge, then give a holler back, cause I'm all that and a bag of chips. Well, what you waiting for, fools? <laughs> I ain't got all day. Hey, Duncan here. But then you probably know me since I'm somewhat of a local celebrity around these parts. Yeah, photographers are taking my picture all the time. It's because of my charm and good looks. And the fact that I live in a big house with tons of security, cameras, and guard dogs. If I had to pick my best quality, I'd say I'm resourceful. Yeah, I'm pretty quick on my feet. Well, it's been nice chat. With you, but I really gotta run. Will I be nervous if I'm chosen to be on the show? <laughs> no. Why should I be? I am extremely comfortable being on national television. I know I look good. Some girls may have issues with their bodies, but maybe they just aren't as pretty as I am. Pick me, and I promise high ratings. Yeah! <laughs> 
I'm going to win total drama revenge of the island because I come from a long line of people who think outside the box. Like my great-grandfather Dave who invented forks. Before him, people just shoved food into their mouths with strips of bark. Yeah, and my great-great-aunt Lois invented plates. Before her, food just sat around the floor getting stepped on. So sad. And my great-great-great-great-uncle George, he invented floors. Before him, the only way you could have a carpet was if you let grass grow on the inside of your house. I can't wait to tell everyone about my family. I just know they'll be impressed. Hi, my name is Dakota, future reality show megastar, fashion model, and eventually award-winning movie actress. Ooh, and maybe pop music star, too, if I have the time. <laughs> you might want to preserve this recording for prosperity. People are going to look back on this audition and see where my path to stardom began. That's right. When I'm done on Total Drama Revenge of the Island, I'm going to be the biggest thing ever. citizens of the universe. I am Dawn, and I am recording this for the purpose of participating in Total Drama Revenge of the Island. <gasps> oh, hello there, blessed little one. I read my tea leaves this morning, and they said that the show would make me a lot of money. Well, money's not important to me. Nature and my animal friends are. It's by channeling their harmony that I will win Total Drama and donate my money to help Mother Earth. <laughs> Yeah, I've got a pretty strict morning routine. Warm up with a little game blob, then hit it hard with the Swede. Yes, got the Sorcerer's Medallion. And punched out the Ninja Overlord. All in a gamer day's work. Oh, man. Blew a fuse again? <laughs> That's cool. Private Brick MacArthur reporting for duty. Permission to explain why I would be a valuable asset to Total Drama. As a military cadet, I have the advantage of razor-sharp senses from years of training. I can take anything you can throw at me. And believe me, when I say nothing gets past me, I mean nothing. Uh -huh. Hi, I'm Emma Maria. And I am so going to win this show, okay? I never really watched Total Drama Rama, whatever, until my girlfriends made me sit through one of those singing episodes, and right away, I knew the show needed me. Check it. <clears throat> you need me like I need a tear. Hi, Mike here, to explain why I would be great for the next Total Drama. For one, I have a lot of different talents to offer. I can be agile and graceful, but also tough and scrappy. With the keen senses of a wilderness survivor, I'm ready to win this season. I don't care what my doctor says. Um, did I say doctor? I meant psychiatrist. Ah, no, I mean, oh, do over. Ow! No. To the producers of Total Drama, you will choose me as a contestant for the following reasons. I am the best, I am the strongest, I am the smartest, and by extension, the meanest. I will win the million dollars, which you will give to me in small unmarked bills. On second thought, you will simply hand the money over to me right now because nobody could possibly be better than me. That is all. Camera on, Pappy? Okay, good. For my audition, I'm gonna demonstrate how my Pappy taught me to hunt for kitchen rats. Yeah! 
There's another critter. How do you like my moves, Chris? Call me. Your little island won't know what hit it. I want to be on Total Drama because... Yeah, I want to meet other teens outside my small town that go to indie theater and wear retro clothes and horn room glasses. <sighs> Every Saturday night, the town jocks drive up and down Main Street cheering for the football team. Seriously, if I get on the show, my worst nightmare would be to get voted off by a jock. <laughs> but what are the chances of that? Man, Chris should have let Lightning be a team of one. Lightning's used to carrying his teams back home, but at least those guys can actually play the game. Not like this bunch of losers. But if Chris is trying to make Lightning look bad, he can't think again. Lightning never gives up and never surrenders. Sh-Lightning! I am what's known as a bubble boy. Growing up, my mom was really overprotective, so I've never gone swimming before. Up until six hours ago, I've never done anything before, except read and sigh a lot. <sighs> but that doesn't mean I'm not a force to be reckoned with. No way! Danaeus Plexippus, the monarch butterfly? Ah! Oh, it's so heavy! Hello! My name is Bierdo. I am pretty shy, and until I warm up to new people, I tend to just make noises and be generally bothersome. I hope that if I am selected, my team can see past that and give me a chance to show them what a great guy I truly am. Thank you. What would make me a good contestant? Well, I've battled armies of vampires and demons from the darkest mountains of Ravenscroft, and I defeated them all with my... Uh, uh, hello? Oh, hey, Timmy. No, can't make it a video. Plus, yesterday someone stole my unicycle. Yes, I'm very serious. Walk, but it's raining. <laughs> no, I'm not made of paper. But my cape is. I just saw Sammy's pathetic audition tape for Total Drama, so I decided to submit my own. Cause, oh my gag, who'd pick her over me? I was born first, and Sammy has been coming in last ever since. My bags are already packed, just send the limo. Rodney here. I just want to say, if you pick me, I'll be leaving behind my special lady, Debbie. We haven't actually spoken yet, but the second we do, I know it's gonna be love. Same goes for Rachel, Alicia, Tammy, Christine, Becky, Mary Lou, Mary Jane. Then there's that girl from the store. Oh, I think it was a girl. It could have been a mannequin. But one thing's for sure, it's true love. They're probably worried I'll meet some new gal on the island. <laughs> what are the chances of that happening? I'm Sammy, not Sammy. I, I don't even know why I said that. No one has ever called me Sammy. I mean, who would, right? Anyway, I don't have a sister or anything. It's pretty much just me. And I'm really confident because of the no sister thing. And... Sammy! Get your butt out here! Uh, I gotta go. Pick me! My name is Ella. I was a huge fan of Total Drama World Tour. I memorized all the songs from that season and performed them at the local mall in a one-person flash mob. The nice security man told me I had a beautiful voice and that I was banned from the mall. Please pick me! My apartment walls are very thin. Sorry, Mr. McGillis! My parents named me Scarlet, a name derived from an English surname with an occupational meaning, referring to a person who sells cloth. Personally, I have higher expectations for myself. The $1 million prize would ensure I am able to attend any university of my choosing. I should add that while the Total Drama series is statistically popular, I believe it is directly responsible for the troubled behavior of today's youth. I thank the selection committee for their time. Topher here. A lot of people have told me I look like a young Chris McLean. In fact, my nickname is Chris 2.0. I gave it to myself. Hey! hey! 
Hey, campers! Time to eat pain! Right, Chef? I don't care about the money. I just want the chance to stare down the barrel of the camera and say, Welcome to Total Drama! Where am I going? Bad Chef! Bad, bad! Where am I going? Ow! Hey! Hi. Dave! Me, I'm... Uh, starting over. Hi, I'm Dave. I'd like to be on your Total Island Thing show. The drama one. Total drama! That's what it's called. I really should have written down what I wanted to say, but the only pen I could find was all chewed up. And not by me. Kind of grossed out just thinking about it. As a competitor, I'd be vicious. All about the money. Not there to make friends, know what I mean? Keep people at arm's length. Grab that cash. I'm gonna play this cold. I feel being a contestant on Total Drama would be a great step towards taking over the world! Bwah ha ha ha! And also meeting people. I don't get out much. I should warn you, I am evil. I know right now you're probably saying, We've had plenty of evil on our show. To that, I say nay. You have never seen evil like me. I am beyond evil. We need a new word for the evil that I am. I've been working on that, but what with my French horn lessons and the babysitting, there's just no time. Australia is home to 11 of the world's deadliest creatures. Oh, and our toilets do not flush backwards. I think that's about all you need to know about where I'm from. Oh. And this is my cat, Whiskers. She's pretty playful. I'm an obvious choice, cause I've been on TV before. Probably recognize me from the Darwin Food Safari restaurant commercial. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm a pro. Hungry for a tasty snack? Zebra 